Okay, this first one here is called Dust Devil. And uh, dust devils are like little baby cyclones you find out west uh, when you're riding. And they don't go anywhere, they just keep spinning. And it's kind of about my dysfunctional family. Okay, Myra suggesting a song that I wrote uh, as I get the capo out, and I'll tell you about it. It takes a second. It's a song called The Magic Lantern, and uh, years ago I was a student, still am in a way, 
of the metaphysics and supernatural and the occult and philosophy. And uh, I was studying the tarot at the time, and there's a card in the tarot called the Hermit. And I was a meditation, I wrote it, a poem about the Hermit, who is the man holding the lantern, the magic lantern. So that's what this song is about. ago when I was first starting to want to play guitar, uh, was Bob Dylan was around. This is in 1964-65. Uh, I was in Catholic high school. It's actually 63. And uh, I heard Dylan and I realized that's what it's all about. You know, write some songs, have a guitar. So that's when I started the whole thing. This is a homage to him. And we call this Love is Never Really Past. Yeah. 
David's still here, but uh, at the church. But it's a, it's a song called The Astral Tourist. And I think it's kind of indicative of what me and Myra are really about. You asked me who I was. I would say I was an astral tourist, you know? We come from star stuff, and here I am taking the journey as a human.
Thank you. Uh, we want to answer these. Okay, uh, am I in tune? Yeah, it's sounds right. Okay, you introduce it. So Johnny wrote this beautiful song called Angeline, and I just can't wait to sing it with him for you. Um, beautiful song. Yeah, uh, it, it's a song about um, wishes that we all have, and, uh, and you know, how we live our lives with imagining different little scenarios, because the human mind is capable of that. So Angeline dreams. Sorry again. Let's do that. Johnny Mystic wrote a song called Cornbread. It was one night we were having chili at my house and I had hot cornbread. And it was his inspiration. Go figure. <laughs> All right, man. I think.
cornbread is kind of like a, a, a staple. Like you, we all need a certain amount of grounding and stability, you know. So that's what this song is about. Cornbread does it for him. <laughs> Ghosts of LA. I'm haunted by the town I once loved and lived in.
when I first moved out here, uh, again, um, about eight years ago. And uh, it's the sentiment I was, I, I kept thinking I was seeing my ex everywhere. <laughs> and I was kind of homesick for LA as well. So I wrote this song, I Keep On Looking. And uh, I think I need the, th the, 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 I think I need a th uh, fingerprint. Yeah, thank you. Yep. Yeah, so this is called I Keep On Looking and see what you think. Mm. mother-in-law who passed away at 103 and and so they said could you write a song from you know for her and I thought well what would it have been like to live to that age so I wrote it as though I'm 103 Looks good for